All right, time for the finale. For last year movies I watched since October 2023. This is it. Well, only one because, um, yeah, well, only one. Here's Five Nights at Freddy's. That movie I saw at um, Century Theater. Yep. I know the game is pretty good. It could be pretty hard sometimes, but hey. Yep, I love Josh Henderson. He's great. I know he starred from The Hunger Games a long time ago with Jennifer Lawrence. Oh yeah, he starred in The Beekeeper. That's right, with Jason Statham. I know I saw that movie before Columbus Day. Yep, so anyway, yeah. This is a great movie from Universal Pictures. Another video game movie from last year. Just like last year, I saw the video game movie, Super Mario Brothers movie. Yep, that was pretty good. But now today we're talking about this movie, Five Nights at Freddy's. Produced by Blumhouse from uh, Megan, now this. Yep, that was my favorite from 2023. I like that one. And also, um, oh yeah, uh, I did rewatch it again. Yep, also. And yes, I did watch it in Peacock. After I saw it in theaters. So, I like this movie. That was pretty good. Five Nights at Freddy's with Josh Henderson. Everyone who loves Five Nights at Freddy's movie, that's great. Especially the game. And also, a long time ago, I did play Five Nights at Freddy's on the, um, on the computer. And I didn't get game over. I'm not lying, okay? No, no, I'm not lying. I survived from the first night to the last without uh, without getting jump scared by Freddy or Barney or Foxy or Chica. Nope, I didn't get jump scared because I survived from the first night to the last on the game long time ago. Phew, thank goodness. But uh, hey, that was a close one. I like this one. This is a great movie, Five Nights at Freddy's. Good thing I rewatch it after I saw it in theaters, and then, yep, I did watch it on Blu-ray combo pack. Using it on my uh, PS4 uh, Pro. Okay, that's it everybody for the last year movies from October 2023.